Nice performance tonight. I'm GM and president of team operations for the Suns. We have the 13th pick in the draft and I'm considering using it on you. I'd like to ask you a couple questions real quick if you don't mind. This offseason, we said goodbye to an era as Steve Nash left our team. With his departure, we're looking to the future for a point guard who can do what he was able to do for us. Do you think you can be that player? I like what you guys are doing in Phoenix, but I just don't think I'm a good fit with your team. I'd rather come into a team that's already established and not one that's in a transition phase. I hope you understand and, and definitely wish you the best of luck. Hello, I'm the general manager for the Portland Trailblazers, and I'd like to thank you for meeting with us. We have a pair of picks in the lottery at the 6th and 11th slots, and would like to ask you a few questions. Aside from a few veterans, this is a very young team. We're bringing in a lot of young talent this offseason, and it won't be easy to get this team back into the playoffs immediately. Are you willing to take your lumps as a team in order to grow as a core along with all the other young talent the Blazers have? Yeah, I definitely am. I don't want to ever get comfortable with winning, but you've shown over the years that you have a strong culture of winning here in Portland. I'm willing to go through the growing pains of being a young team if it means we'll be that much tighter of a unit down the road. You feel me? Hey, how's it going? Good game tonight. I'm the scouting director for the Bucks. We have the 14th pick in the draft, and I'm considering using it on you. I'd like to ask you a couple questions real quick, if you don't mind. With our backcourt combination of Brandon Jennings and Monte Ellis, we feel we have a lot of scoring potential at our one and two spots. It also means it'll be a battle to see the floor with those two on our team. Are you prepared to fit into a rotation with them if it means you might not get all the minutes you feel you deserve? I mean, the way it comes off to me is that you guys seem to be set in your backcourt. I'm honored you'd like to pair me up with those two great players, but to be honest, I'm not really interested in coming to Milwaukee and having to fight for a starting role. I'm just a better player than that. Welcome to the 2012 NBA Draft. For 60 of the world's most talented and dedicated young players, tonight marks the culmination of years of hard work as their dream of playing in the NBA moves closer to reality. With the first pick in the 2012 NBA Draft, the New Orleans Hornets select Anthony Davis from the University of Kentucky. With the second pick in the 2012 NBA Draft, the Charlotte Bobcats select Michael Kidd Gilchrist from the University of Kentucky. With the third pick in the 2012 NBA Draft, the Washington Wizards select Bradley Beal from the University of Florida. With the 10th pick in the 2012 NBA Draft, the New Orleans Hornets select Austin Rivers from Duke University. With the 11th pick in the 2012 NBA Draft, the Portland Trailblazers select the 20-year-old point guard from the University of Texas.